Hey y'all, it's Angie and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been like a month or so since my last video, but here we are because I decided to spend more money. Last month I celebrated my birthday and Forever 21 had a 50% off clearance item sale. So I just lucked up on it. I went to the mall for something else and I just so happened to park by Forever 21, you know, so I could walk through and just see what they had. Well, in the midst of me seeing what they had, they ended up having a 50% off their clearance item sale. So what did I do? I just picked up a few items and it said selected items that's on clearance. So I go to the register, I say, hey, whatever's not the additional 50% off, I don't want it. And so she threw everything in my bag and I said, so everything was the extra 50%? She said, yes. So I said, okay. I went to the store that I originally came there for and then I went back and then I went to another Forever 21 the next day because why not so I'm going to start with those items and um, I think I did way better than I did in the last haul when I bought everything these items are much more they were worth it it was it was worth it I feel like I really got great deals this time around so stay tuned if you want to see what I picked up Okay, so in the very first Forever 21 bag, like I said, I went to the store, I left out and then came back. So this is out of the first batch. I received, I got six items, a total of $18.56. So that means that on average, I paid about $3 per item. So I'm gonna keep this receipt out so I can tell you how much I paid for it. The first thing I'm going to show is this rose gold colored dress. It is so pretty and it fits so well that I wore this for my birthday when I went to Las Vegas recently. It is so pretty and if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see the picture. And I paid $4.50 for this. So it was $9, but with the 50% off, it was $4.50. I found, so y'all know how I am with black. If it's black, I'm going to get it. This dress was $7, so $3.50. You see that? Oh, those little, the little cutout detail in here and right there fits like a glove. It is a, a ribbed sweater type of material for this dress, so I will be wearing it in the winter or whenever I get a chance, a size small. And yeah, $3.50 for that. Let me make sure. Yep. Kaplan dress $3.50. I got another sweater dress. This one was $5, so it was $2.50. Another ribbed material, burgundy or a wine color. Very long, comes down to my calves. And this is a size small as well. I don't think that I'll be trying these on. That's just going to take up a little bit more time than what I have, but. This one, yes, $2.50 for this one. They have it as, let's see. Yeah, they have it as red, not wine or anything like that. It doesn't look red, but okay. Another black dress. Woo child. This dress is a, probably a calf length dress. This one has like the little fake little bra, little, um, I don't know if you can see that little the little circle that makes it look like there is a, a built-in bra this one was five dollars in size medium and uh this one two dollars and fifty cent black dress yes two dollars and fifty cent it says knee length dress and then i think the last item that i found because y'all know i'm gaining weight if you don't know now you know i'm gaining weight so i have to step my jeans game back up and i got these uh, wax jeans, but I love you is what they're called size nine Little bitty of me in a size nine. Can you believe it? Nine and these were nine dollars. So they were four dollars and fifty cents Just some regular blue jeans that I need They have uh, their high-rise push-up jeans size nine and uh, 
I guess they lift your butt up a little bit, which I don't think I need any help with that. But they were $4.50 as well. And then as I got to the register, I saw a pair of glasses. These were $3, I think. So yes, they were $3, so I paid $1.50 for these. And I wore these to Las Vegas as well. Cute, right? Yes. So that was the first bag. And then, like I said, I left that store and then went to another store and came right back. I told the cashier, don't judge me, because I ended up going back to the same cashier. And it, it was weird, though, because, you know, most cashiers don't pay attention or don't make eye contact. But she looked at me. And then she just kind of smirked and laughed. I was like, don't judge me. Yes, I'm back. So an hour later, I went back and I took my time and I started looking through more items. And I found this dress, which if you follow me on Instagram, I wore this for my birthday. Can you see this? Look at this. This dress, it has a slit in it, just like the other one this dress it was so cute on but the only thing is the had i known that the breast part was going to kind of show that black lining i would have sewn that down a bit so that you didn't see it um i did a whole lot of pulling it when i did wear it but nonetheless this dress was let's see gunmetal dress this was seven dollars but I paid $3.50 for it. But this, it fits like a glove. I love it so much and I was so excited. I had dresses planned for my birthday, but when I saw those two dresses, game over. <laughs> game over. So on my second trip, I spent $21.29 and I got five items. So I don't know where I'm going to wear this hound's tooth print dress. It's cute. It's a little uh, above the knee, but I mean, I thought it was just so cute and it was $9, so I paid $4.50 for it, but I thought this was just the cutest thing and it fits really well. It has another slit in it. Uh, it fits really well. Most of these things, not most, all of them fit really well and I wish I could try them on, but I probably won't. I just got these, um, it's called the Ella. Just some trousers for work. Always, you can't get too many uh, work pants. And uh, I don't wear a uniform or anything, but these are good to kind of like just, they're breathable and it's a size large. But I tried them on and they, they fit pretty well. They were $2.50, so they were $5. Oh, the tag is on here. Or maybe it's not. Well, two fifty for some pants I can wear to work. I don't mind it. Another pair of pants for work. These are an olive green pair of pants. Hopefully the color is coming off. Nine dollars, so I paid four fifty. Another size large. This is the back, and this is the front. It has like the little belt buckle things on it to kind of tighten up. They fit really well. Four fifty for those, and. This is, the sticker's rubbing off, but it, it was $9. This is a very long, I don't even know if this is a midi or it has a, a slit as well, but I think this, this is like an ankle length skirt. But what I thought I could do with it is to wear it like um, a bandeau top. What's the word I'm looking for? Like uh, just like a long dress and then kind of put like maybe a belt around here and use this as just the top and it still comes to my knees past my knees actually but I tried it on like this and it looks it, it looks really well so that's what I'm, I'm not gonna wear that as an actual skirt because I would kind of look um, I don't want to say like Amish or anything but it would just kind of look it's too long it's really long but here's the five dollar sign for the uh, pants that I had but that that's my second haul so I got five items for $21 so it's almost like I paid $4 each for everything in this bag and lastly I went to another forever 21 in a different mall and I spent 
$10.92 on four items. So, you know, I paid less than $2, well, about $2 per item, $2.50 maybe for uh, each item. This one, um, yeah, this was the next day, a couple of days before I went out of town. This dress was $3. I'm pretty sure you can see that sign. And it's a turtleneck, mauve pinkish colored sweater dress, which I will wear next winter. $3, so I paid $1.50 for this dress. And I've been saying that this mauve pink color, that I don't like pink because it feels kind of young to me. I like red, but I've been really loving this mauve color on me. It's been looking really, really, really cute. Then I found this shirt. No, this definitely wasn't Forever 21. This was from Dee Dee's. This shirt is $2. I don't know how this got into that bag. I guess this was a part of my shopping, but a Dee Dee shirt for $2. <laughs> I found these uh, snake print. I'm about to say leopard print. These snake print little flats for five dollars so these were 250 they look kind of big but it's a size six and a half they look huge though but i could wear those to work i found i don't even remember this but i found this pink it's more like a coral this coral colored dress probably knee length comes to your knees probably um has a really cute little I don't know what these necklines are called when it's straight, but it's kind of low. This was $5, so I paid $2.50 for this as well, and it's a size small. Stretching material, so you know I can fit in that. And then another thing, a pair of black jeans. As if I don't have a million black jeans already, but these are size 28 high rise skinny these were nine dollars but again i paid 450 and yeah they're, they're stretchy size 28 i need them it is what it is <laughs> i think that was it for that haul so yeah four items and that one i spent uh 10.92 so a total of like 60 dollars on a bunch of items you can't really beat that i don't know if the sale is still going on again this was at the end of march right before my birthday when i went and i i think i did pretty well i fared out pretty well oh also since dds had um i found these slippers in dds they were two dollars let me see if i still have the tag for them hold on yep these slippers were two dollars at dds they were, oh, City Trends. That's where that shirt came from, City Trends. I don't know why I was thinking Dee Dee's. And then I saw the, hold up, the yellow sticker, City Trends. City Trends, City Trends, City Trends. $2 for the slippers and then $2 for the shirt at City Trends. Um, I don't know what else I got from City Trends or where the bag is, why I did not save it for this haul i may not have gotten that many things but that's the end of my haul i hope that you all enjoy go to your forever 21 and let me know if the sale is still going on because nope i'm not spending any more money that's it i'm done bye guys <laughs>